Hi, welcome to the demonstration of SQL Data Generator from Redgate Software. I'm Steve Jones, and here I'm going to show you how SQL Data Generator easily populates SQL Server databases with sensible intelligent test data. Once populated, the databases can then be tested and further developed. Let's look at our demo. When you start a new project in SQL Data Generator, you first select the location of the database that you wish to populate with test data. The database can either be on your local machine or on a network server. Here we're going to populate the Northwind database located on the msts.testnet server. Once you have selected a server, SQL Data Generator makes it easy for you to choose which database on that server you wish to populate. You can now populate the database with intelligent meaningful test data by simply clicking Generate Data. An action plan provides a summary of the data generation for you to review. A report is published detailing the data that has been generated. You can now save the project and then open it again at a later date if required. This nicely demonstrates the simplicity and ease of use of SQL Data Generator. The rest of this demonstration will show you how to customize the generated data. Once again, select the Northwind database. The Northwind database schema is listed in a tree view in the Tables to Populate pane on the left. Here you can select which tables to populate with test data by checking the Populate checkbox. A preview of the data that will be generated can be instantly seen. SQL Data Generator has automatically assigned an appropriate generator based on column name. When you have selected the Populate checkbox for a table, you can define how you want the data to be generated. Click the table name in the Tables to Populate pane and specify the details in the Table Generation Settings pane. You now have two options for generating the data. You can either create data automatically using generators or import your own data. With the Generate Data box checked, SQL Data Generator automatically assigns an appropriate generator based on column name. Alternatively, you can use data from an existing SQL's table or view, or a CSV file of an existing data source. In this demo, we will use SQL Data Generator to automatically generate data. In the Table Generation Settings, you can adjust the number of rows to be generated. You can also choose whether to delete existing data from the database prior to population or not. This option is useful when you want to add test data to existing data. In this demo, we will populate the whole database with test data, so we will select all the columns and also check the Delete Existing Data box. You will see that the data that will be generated is instantly viewable in the preview pane. There is no button to click, the data just appears. You can now check the settings for each of the table columns and customize them as desired. For example, let's look at the data in the Employees table, the Title column. Click on either the column name in the Tables to Populate pane or in the Preview pane. You can see that even photographs have been assigned. In the Column Generation Settings pane, you can select the generator to be used for each column. The regular expression can easily be customized. For example, adding Prof to the Title of Courtesy column. The Seed option allows you to regenerate exactly the same data as a previous project if required. Now let's take a look at another column in another table. Select the Order Details table in the Quantity column. Notice in the Column Generation Settings pane you can alter the minimum and maximum values. Here you can see that the generators have taken into constraints into account by starting at 1. You can also change the distribution of the data from random to sequential. When you're happy with the settings for the data you wish to generate, click Generate Data. An action plan provides a summary of the data generation for you to review. A report is published detailing the data that has been generated. You can now save the project and then open it again at a later date if required. I hope this demo has given you a taste of the usefulness of SQL Data Generator. It can help to dramatically speed up your database development work by automating those tedious and error-prone tasks, leaving you to add more creative value to your project. Now you can try out a fully functional version of SQL Data Generator by downloading the 14-day free trial here. I'm Steve Jones for Redgate Software.